A Dallas home is becoming a place of grace for a North Texas woman and people with similar struggles. For nearly 20 years, she has been free of a life of drugs, and now her mission is to help others on this journey that has led her back to her roots. Fox 4 Sean Ramp has her story. A sprucing up outside this house in Northeast Dallas. A shoring up inside for what will be a place of grace. This is actually my grandmother's home. Anika Cooper's dream of having a home to help women break the chains of drugs and alcohol coming to pass. Cooper calls it Simply Grace, named after her grandmother who saved her from drug addiction. She told us that story a year ago. She had to carry me up the stairs because I was so, I was so weak. I had been up for two weeks. And that day, that next day um, is when God saved my life. Her middle name was Grace, and she was really where I came 17 years ago. This exact living room, actually, is where I came 17 years ago for refuge when I was ready to stop getting high. So the girls will know when they walk in that this is their safe haven, and they can get refuge here as well. Team Home Depot from the White Rock Lake store make over the home where women will soon make over their lives. Monika told me about her own story, dealing with a drug and alcohol dependency growing up. Thompson moved by Cooper's motivation, yeah, the darker one. provided not only a grant for the materials, but the manpower. Kind of hit close to home. Everybody on our leadership team, when we talked about this project, knew somebody, was related to somebody, had a friend who's dealt with um, addiction of some sort and had trouble overcoming it. And we thought, man, we even have associates in the store who've gone through some programs like this. So we thought, man, what a great way to give back, help people get back on their feet, um, get back involved in society. Her dream will be fulfilled in May when the first women come for help. So the women will have not only a place to live, but a beautiful place to live. A place of hope and simply grace. Sean Rabb, Fox 4 News.